Hello, thanks for joining me. My name is Rachel Nesvig and I play the Hardanger fiddle, the national folk instrument of Norway. I'm super excited to be playing again this year for the Vista Viking Festival. I had a great time playing last year and I'm going to play some tunes for you. The first tune is called Fiken and it's a hauling, a very acrobatic dance. Enjoy. lively dance. And the next tune I'm going to play is also a dance. Most of the tunes are dance tunes. And this is called Torbjörn Valsen. Torbjörn means thunder bear in Norwegian. And this is actually a very um, friendly, fun waltz that maybe doesn't sound like a thunder bear, but I hope you enjoy it. thinking while I was playing that, that um, even though it doesn't sound like Thunder Bear, Torbjörn is a fairly common name in Norway. And so this tune is probably just named after someone named Torbjörn who liked the dance or maybe composed it even. All right. 
The next tune I'm going to play is called Eskesekken, and it is a springar from Valdres. And springars are dances that have a little spring to the step, and there's a wide variety of types of springars depending on the region you're from in Norway. So enjoy this one, Eskesekken. The next tune I'll play is called Klunken, and it is a Rhinelander. So if you've ever danced a Schottisch, it's very similar. Kind of have a one, two, three, hop, one, two, three, hop, step, hop, step, hop, step, hop, step, hop. So you can kind of hear that in this tune. Thank you. 
get a little darker now. This tune is called Gamla Erik, and it's also a hauling, like the first dance I played. And this is about the devil. And it's one of the only tunes that I know for Hard Iron Fiddle that actually sounds pretty dark, as opposed to sounding pretty happy or kind of modal or somewhere in, in between that. So here's Gamla Erik. also really fun to play. So I remember learning that on the mountaintop somewhere in southwestern Norway and it felt like an amazing place to learn that tune. So I'm at my halfway point and if you would like to hear more Hard Iron Fiddle, there's lots of resources out there but I also have my own YouTube channel. So just type in my name Rachel Nesvig and that's the name of my channel. I also have a website, rachelnestwig.com, where you can find out more information and find out any upcoming live stream shows and when it's safe to do so, any in-person shows. I am currently based in Seattle, but I'm, some of you listening are probably from Southern California. So hello, thanks for watching. And I'm definitely gonna have a live stream show soon. So you can tune into that. All right, the next tune is called Ja Nordajert, which means, yes, now it is done. And traditionally, this is played after a couple gets married. Yes, we're married, it's done. <laughs> so it's a Vasa rule, it's kind of a circular dance. And yeah, enjoy. <laughs>
tune I will play is called Sindbuken, and it is a springer, that springy dance from Vestland, which means Western Norway, Southwestern Norway specifically, and this springer is a little more even than the other springer that I played earlier. All right, it's called Sindbuken. to take it down a notch and I'm going to play a tune for, for you called Grotteschlager, which literally means weeping tune. And this is a sad wedding song because the parents of the bride are so sad that their daughter is going away. <laughs> so a lot of times when a couple got married in Norway, um, one of the people would have to go far away and live with the person they end up marrying and maybe they won't see their family for a very long time because there's so many fjords in Norway that it's really hard to travel. So the bride's parents in this song are sad that their daughter's leaving them. Grotoslaga.
okay. That song always brings me into a different place. I hope it brought you to a different place as well. I have two more tunes. Um, the first one is called Laus Etter Ula Deco or Trusugun. It has two titles. And this is another hauling, one of my favorite types of dances to play. Um, you should definitely look up hauling dance, H-A-L-L-I-N-G. It's very acrobatic dance. polka. So very different from the other dances. If you can envision a polka, they do kind of a one dun 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 That was very clear, I'm sure. <laughs> um, but yes, you can look up a polka and see. Um, this, called, this one is called Gudmund's Dansen and is named after a guy named Gudmund that liked this dance. to the Hardanger Fiddle in Norwegian. It's called the Hardingfela. And you can find me on Instagram, rachel.nesvig. You can find my website, rachelnesvig.com. My YouTube channel, Rachel Nesvig. And 
yeah, I appreciate any donations for the free musicians of <laughs> the free musicians, the freelance musicians of the world um, right now. And that's also Rachel Nusvig, PayPal, Venmo, you name it. Thanks so much. And I hope that I can come and play at the Viking Festival in 2021. So I hope you're doing well and staying safe. <laughs>